The Little Red Hen Once upon a time, there was a little red hen who lived on a farm with her animal friends. The little red hen worked hard every day. She picked up dirt to keep the barnyard clean and found worms to feed her chicks. The other animals on the farm were lazy. They never helped the little red hen. They preferred to relax. One day, as she was scratching around in the barnyard, she found some grains of wheat. We can plant these tiny grains and they will grow, thought the little red hen. So she asked, who will help me plant these grains of wheat? Not I, quacked the duck. Not I, meowed the cat. Not I, oinked the pig. Then I will do it myself, clucked the little red hen. And that is just what she did. She planted the grains of wheat all by herself. Every day, she checked to see how the wheat plants were growing. She pulled the weeds around them to give the wheat room to grow. By the end of the summer, those seeds of wheat had sprouted. Not only had they sprouted, they had grown into tall stalks of ripening golden grain. At long last, the stalks of wheat were ripe and the wheat grain was ready to be harvested. The little red hen looked excitedly at the field of golden wheat. The little red hen asked, Who will help me cut the wheat? Not I, quacked the duck. Not I, meowed the cat. Not I, oinked the pig. Then I will do it myself, clucked the little red hen. And that is just what she did. She cut the wheat all by herself. When she had cut the wheat, the little red hen sighed happily. Then she asked, Who will help me grind this wheat into flour? Not I, quacked the duck. Not I, meowed the cat. Not I, oinked the pig. Oh, then I will do it myself, clucked the little red hen. And that is just what she did. She ground the wheat all by herself. When the wheat had been ground into flour, the little red hen clucked cheerfully. Then she asked, Now, who will help me make this flour into bread dough? Not I, quacked the duck. Not I, meowed the cat. Not I, oinked the pig. Then I will do it myself, clucked the little red hen. And that is just what she did. She made the flour into bread dough all by herself. When she mixed the dough, the little red hen joyfully fluffed up her feathers. Then she asked, Who will help me bake the bread? Not I, quacked the duck. Not I, meowed the cat. Not I, oinked the pig. Then I will do it myself, clucked the little red hen. And that is just what she did. And so, all by herself, the little red hen baked a fine loaf of bread. As the bread cooked, wonderful smells rose up into the air. The smells were so good that the animals could almost taste the bread. Now, she said, who will help me eat the bread? I will, quacked the duck. I will, meowed the cat. I will, oinked the pig. Aha, clucked the little red hen. No, you will not. I planted the wheat all by myself. I cut the wheat all by myself. I ground the wheat into flour all by myself. I mixed the dough and baked it all by myself. And now I will eat the bread all by myself. And that is just what she did. She ate the bread all by herself. The end. And now, boys and girls, it's time for a shout out to one of our favorite channels Bedtime Stories with Annie. She does read alouds too and does wonderful books such as Mr. Willoughby's Christmas Tree and Never Ask a Dinosaur to Dinner. If you want more bedtime stories, be sure to check out her channel. Thanks for watching.